afternoon. <laughs> Didn't vlog yet today because I had a really exciting meeting this morning that I can't tell you about, which is the most annoying thing I think YouTubers do when they tell you about something that they can't tell you about. I am going to get lunch and I thought that this week would be pretty jokes if I did a vlog and I wore the same t-shirt for five days and showed you like five different outfits that you can wear with t-shirt. <laughs> is this gonna get stinky? Maybe. So this is the t-shirt. It's my Uncle Studios t-shirt in a large or an extra large. I just wanted it oversized, but the t-shirt is not supposed to fit like this. It's supposed to be like a slim fitting t-shirt, but I just thought I'd have more variety if I wore an oversized t-shirt for this challenge. So the first outfit <laughs> that I'm wearing is very basic. It is, it's just this white t-shirt and then my Everlane, uh, skinny high-waisted skinny jeans and then I'm wearing high top Converse, which I'm putting on right now. And my Converse are white, but they're so old, they're basically gray. Then I'm gonna wear a trench and it's the same look that I wore in my spring outfits video, but this is my first outfit of the week. Let's see how many outfits I can get out of this one t-shirt. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna get some lunch. So I wore a trench with this this morning, but it's honestly pretty cold outside, so I decided to wear a warmer coat with this look. I mean, pretty basic outfit. Mondays are meeting and content ideas day, so I'm mostly at home the whole day, but we just went out to go to Metro to get some lunch. So we picked up some ingredients and Joey's gonna cook lunch because everything was literally closed that we tried to go to. <laughs> a lot of people said that they wanted me to vlog more about what I was eating. This morning for breakfast I had two eggs, avocado, just like sliced avocado with salt, and a sweet potato hash. And then for lunch, Joey just made this. We just went to the grocery store and got some ingredients and then Joey made um, chicken with what tastes like lemon, garlic, but just like very simple. Let me just have this rice and then this Brussels sprout. I'm just gonna drink water for lunch and eat this and then continue on with the work day. Also, I have this like broccoli plate thing um, that I'm just gonna like snack on. The afternoon, cause I feel like, I don't know if this is TMI, but like when I'm on my period, and like just before on my period, I'm like so hungry all the time. And then like after my period, I'm like not hungry at all. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, back to work for me. All right, I decided to film a video. And if you think that you get more professional as you keep making YouTube videos, this is my setup right now. I have a light on the floor and I'm using toilet paper to film my video. <laughs> Let's do it. All right, just finished my video and it will be up before this video. So if you haven't seen it, go watch it because it's my tips on how I feel and stay confident before events, meetings, stuff like that. Um, and my, yeah, my tips on how to look and feel your best. So that'll be linked in the cards and down below. Now I have to edit the video because it was due a while ago to the client. Whoops. But my mom is gonna come over in a bit, I think, unless she bails on me, which would be classic. Um, my mom is actually coming over to open up an investment account with me. My mom's in finance and um, yeah, she's. I need to start investing my money properly because I'm an adult now. Um, so she's just helping me open a account that lets you like invest money, so. Real adult shit, you know? Okay, so my mother just came over to help me open an investing account, um, like a trading account for money. And I'm trying to decide if I like, with this whole week's vlog about wearing this t-shirt every day, if like I have one outfit, can I like change my outfit for the night? Or I'm just like have to always wear this t-shirt and I'm not sure what the rules are yet. But I'm definitely gonna have to wash this t-shirt midweek because I think it's like kind of fucked to wear the same shirt every day not washing it. I'm just gonna wear these camo pants with my white t-shirt. And then I'm gonna obviously wear shoes, probably just white sneakers and or Converse. I will link this stuff down below, obviously. We are gonna grab some food because we actually don't have any food in the house. Um, I think we're gonna get tacos 
maybe from Zola and the Beaches, which is my favorite taco place, I think, in the city. And yeah, that's what we're gonna do. So I'm just gonna wear this and then probably winter coat because it is fucking cold out. Like, oh, it's so cold. Then I was like looking through my Instagram memories and I saw that when I go back from Coachella last year, it was snowing in Canada. So I'm praying that that doesn't happen this year because I just can't handle it. I'm actually just wearing a leather jacket because I don't know, I just felt like it. Definitely too cool to wear this. Home now from dinner and we just have a little bit of work to do. So we are actually creating a custom fabric for uncle that has like a design on it. And I'm not super skilled at illustrator, but Joey is. So he is gonna help just like size it out. So we're using these dresses as like comparison to how big the design is gonna be on the dress. And then we're measuring it, and then Joey's gonna help me out with the illustrator thing. You wanna start with this one? This one's the one on my mind. drinking this coffee because we ran out of Nespresso and we're kind of feeling going back to French press for a little. It's Tuesday and I've been editing and doing my taxes all morning, but I have to go out. So this is my groundbreaking t-shirt outfit for today. I am wearing the same t-shirt, black jeans, these like snakeskin crowboy boots and a cardigan. It's honestly so cold outside that it's like, I don't want to wear anything because it's still so cold and it's March. So let me give you a better. I mean, nothing. I mean, pretty groundbreaking. Jeans and a t-shirt and a cardigan. And then boots. Keep it kind of interesting, but then I'm probably putting like a big ass winter coat on. Okay, I took the cardigan off and just doing a coat. <sighs> Very uninspired by this. Shitty weather. I like this jean and boot combo though. Very like cowboy. It's fine. Not wearing any makeup either, so. We got pho for lunch and spring rolls, but they're eaten. <laughs> We're home and I'm looking greasy and we're, we're doing work, but I'm about to incorporate my company. I'm a real company. A real business lady. Allegra Shaw Media LTD. That's me. Submit. Submit. That was really climactic. I hadn't picked up packages in a few days, like three days maybe. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot for three days, damn. I finally bought metal straws, lol that it comes in plastic. I bought these really big ones for like smoothies and stuff. And then I bought some skinnier ones just for like water. And it comes with these little cleaners, but really happy to finally have metal straws because that was something I was definitely missing. When I was in New York, I went to Fresh Beauty and they gifted me with so much product, but I'm really excited to try out all this stuff. Um, so a face cleanser, I have used this before. I love it and I got the travel size when I was there and then they gave me the full size one. I'm really excited to use it because I have to wash my face before I use Benzogel because you can't use Benzogel as like a face wash because it literally burns your eyeballs off. Rose, <clears throat> Rose Deep Hydration Toner. Really heard good things about that too. Umbrian Clay Purifying Face Exfoliant. Like I've heard amazing things about all of this stuff and I've only used a few. Seabury um, Moisturizing Face Oil. Fresh Creme Ancienne, Ancienne Soft Cream. And this is like hand made by monks in Prague or something. Pretty crazy. I got the Black Tea Firming Eye Serum, which I need a new eye cream and serum and stuff. Lotus Youth Preserve Dream Face Cream. Umbrian Clay Purifying Mask. Youth Preserve Rescue Mask. Shower 
gel and some body lotion that smells amazing. I got the lychee scent. Deep hydration, rose deep hydration face serum. And I was with someone from the Fresh team and oh, yeah, I got the floral face toner. Um, this is just like a little spray that I like to bring on airplanes and I don't really have a lot of those. And then I got a bunch of their lip products because I love their lip products. I got the Sugar Scrub lip polish, which I literally need right now because my lips are so dry. But this stuff is amazing if you haven't tried it. But it's just like a, sh a lip polish. It's really good and I need this today. I got the Black Tea Kombucha Facial Essence. And on the lip front as well, I got the Sugar Cream Lip Treatment and Buff and the Sugar Spice Lip Treatment and the Sugar Lip Serum Advanced Therapy, just like the normal one. Just a bunch of lip products because I feel like I go through lip products pretty quickly. Rose Deep Hydration Face Cream, Black Tea Age Delay Eye Concentrate. I've heard amazing things about that. And then last, I got the mint lip one. So, a ton of really good stuff. Thank you, Fresh, so much. It was such a nice experience. If you haven't been to one of their stores in like New York, highly recommend. Beautiful. But I'm super excited to like try all these products out and see which ones work for me. Let me know if you have any Fresh products that you absolutely love. And I just realized that this lip product from Fresh has SPF in it. That's perfect because I'm going to some hot locations. Mm, this one's mint though. That one's nice. And then the, I'll show you the colors, I guess, since we're sitting here. This one is Spice. I'm also such a lip balm person that like these are so nice. That's the color, really nice. That's really nice. And then yeah, it's more of like a, like a tube like this. Mm, very similar. One's a little more pink and one's a little more orange. Nice, very excited. Mm, this is their lip serum. Wow, so many fun things to play with. And I can't believe I have a new face spray for the plane. I've been needing one so badly. Okay, anyway, we have to go to the gym now because we didn't go this morning, which we usually go in the mornings, which I like better, but we just couldn't go this morning. Hey, what you doing? Taking an Instagram photo. The glamorous life of a blogger. My legs are literally shaking. She got these fucking cloudy boots here. They're fucking They're great. They're Celine. Celine. Salam. I said I wasn't going to shop and then I bought these because they're so hard to find. Okay, can you actually take this photo for me because I'm having a hard time. We're watching One Strange Rock and then this is dinner tonight. You guys said you wanted to see more of like what we eat. So we made very similar to what we had the other day. We're trying to keep it pretty clean before we go away just because it's hard to eat really healthy when we go away. So this is just chicken, broccoli, Brussels sprout, kind of like slaw kind of thing and then rice. Since we're going to Italy and sometimes cheese can be hard to stay away from, like it'll be in things that you just don't know. I bought these lactose taste digest pills. Never tried them, but I bought them. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm allergic to lactose or I'm allergic to hormones in the milk in North America, but we'll give them a try. Good morning. Still wearing my white tee. I was actually gonna try to wear this with like a dress or something today to like really show you a different outfit, but um, it's still cold. So this is my look today. Wearing my white tee, Uncle T, my Goldie Sherry jeans, this soft skin jacket, and then my new Celine boots. We have to go. We're going to a meeting. So, what do you really think of the logo? It's just the best array of sunshine. I do the same thing every time I go. <laughs> You know how you see yourself in the mirror is not this what isn't this isn't it, and this isn't what people see. And this is what people. This see. is what people see, yeah. and it's horrible. It's very confusing. <laughs> okay, so we finished our two, three meetings this morning. We had a meeting with. Um, we're still like securing a space. Meeting with a graphic designer. Just you know, meetings which some people don't really want to hear about. But I'm with Joey. Insurance in the back. Pop your head the other way. I look so much better when I have a bit of a tan. It's insane. Like when I'm so pale, I look disgusting. When I have a like 
an ounce of color, it's like, wow, you're alive. Are you tan right now? Like a little bit, like more than, I was at my birthday where I was um, as a piece of paper. <laughs> you know, you'd be so disappointed. Well, no, you'd be proud because I put so much sunscreen on, but my scalp burnt. Yeah, I you need hair sunscreen. I didn't know that was a thing. Yeah, yeah, I didn't. And every morning it looks like I have fucking dandruff because my hair, my scalp is peeling. It's so disgusting. Like I'm like picking up. Oh my up. God, that was dangerous. <laughs> yeah, so Sharin, when we were in Greece like a few years ago was like, I don't need sunscreen. I'm stronger than the sun. And literally burnt to a crisp. I'm like, yeah, you deserve that. My cheekbones are like right under my she, eyes. Her face like third was puffy burn. because yeah. she was so burnt. <laughs> I mean, honestly, you deserve it. You're like, I'm tougher than the sun. I don't need sunscreen. Yeah, now I realize like I have sensitive skin. Like my scalp instantly. It also doesn't matter. Burn. Even if you don't like burn, burn, you still need to like put on sunscreen. No. If you live in Canada, your skin never sees sun. Okay, we have one more meeting and then we have other work to do. Good morning, happy Thursday. Whew, this week's kind of going by quickly. Um, still in my white tee, but I'm actually gonna wear a sweatshirt over this today. I don't know if that's cheating, but I guess like it's my game, so. Um, I also did have to wash it last night because um, I bit into a red pepper and it literally got all over my shirt. But I'm gonna wear a gray sweatshirt over top just cause it's raining and it's like minus one outside. So um, I don't really wanna be cold. But this morning I had a meeting with Taylor from Nude Sticks. She's one of the co-founders and friend of mine. So we are gonna get breakfast. And then I have a quite a lot to do before I leave. I have a lot of like self care things to do, you know, like get my nails done, stuff like that, that I feel like I always end up leaving to the last minute, which kind of sucks. And then you like are like packing in all these appointments that you like normally wouldn't do before you leave i don't know what so for my outfit today these are my vintage levi's jeans i'll show you in like a proper mirror but i think i'm just gonna wear a sweatshirt and like a trench coat and some booties or something because it's looking pretty pretty gross outside i really want to wear my celine boots but um it's raining so i don't know if that's a good idea originally i was gonna like try to really style the t-shirt you know like different ways and like skirts and dresses it's just too cold out i think i've already said this but i feel like this video showed you that you can wear jeans and a t-shirt every day and no one will know that you're wearing the same thing every day because no one cares um, obviously i've changed my jeans out a bunch but same t-shirt same jeans similar looks every day and like literally no one has said anything i'm going no sweatshirt because my sweatshirt is wet <laughs> Just like a, a mess today. Shall I need sunglasses? I'll bring them. Full look. So basically I've worn boots, different jeans, the same t-shirt and a different trench coat every single day, which is not very helpful, is it? We'll try to switch it up tomorrow or later today. <laughs> Got some exciting uncle samples in some dresses they look really good i'm gonna try them on now this is sample number one yeah this is nice like it's not super tight obviously you wouldn't wear a bra but very cute yeah the zipper needs to be moved to the side i think i mean it's not bad in the back it would just need to be a bit shorter yeah this is nice but i think it's like i think it'll be Nice on a lot of different body types. Yeah, especially because there is stretch. It'll if you work. have big hips, like it'll, this will stretch out. If you have big boobs, we have some stretch here. Very easy. Get yeah, on very. Okay, next. Very. Cute. I like this. Yeah, I think this is a really nice. Like it doesn't look wedding-y. You could wear it to your wedding if you wanted. That would be epic. But like. No, I don't think it looks wedding. No, I don't think so either. I think like you know. Like some flat sandals, strappy heels. Like. Look at Princess starting her Friday morning. I haven't seen you since this morning. Um, this morning I got a spray tan from Jen, a beloved tan. I always get my spray tans in Toronto from her. She's amazing. So um, I did that and then guys, I kind of failed on the white t-shirt thing because I had a spray tan. So um, I didn't wear white. And then I wore a jean sh skirt, jean 
jumpsuit and I spilled coffee all over myself. Um, and then I just have been working on some really boring, boring stuff that you guys don't really wanna see. But I am now packing for 17 days away in multiple different climates. <laughs> so, um, well not like too, they don't vary too much, but so these are all my dresses that I'm packing. I need to add one more to this, but I can't find my tunic dress. Oh, I used it in, uh, I'll need to look for that. But dresses and I'm gonna pack in cubes and then pack in my suitcases. Um, and then I'm watching Grey's Anatomy while I do that. And then I'm going to see my mom tonight for dinner. You know, I just complained about wearing a white t-shirt that I'm like going to see my parents and stuff for dinner. And I just put on another white t-shirt and I'm wearing the same thing. You really feel like we've really gotten to know each other this week. And you can tell that I wear the same thing most days. <laughs> Why am I a fashion YouTuber and vlogger? I don't know. Okay. All right. I'm vlogging. Okay, so um, I actually packed into cubes. This is my suitcase. It's from away. I like the suitcase way better because it has these like snap enclosure instead of a zipper enclosure, it's way better. All right, so I'm doing a big suitcase and a little suitcase and Joey's bringing a big suitcase, but I have these like packing cubes and I'm gonna be packing in those. That's the way that I like to pack. Here, the cubes. So all my dresses are in here, all my pants are in this one. Oh, bathing suits. I already pulled all my bathing suits. I'm bringing a lot so I can shoot and have content for after, but I already pulled them from my bathing suit drawer. I'm gonna bring this new one, the solid and striped one, 437, yellow. And then this one is from Tropic of Sea, 437 again. Maybe, yeah, this one too. Yeah, that one's nice. So I'm bringing a lot of bathing suits. I see the top now. There's so many tops. A black triangle top. Okay. All right, so that's a lot of bathing suits, but that's fine. And then throw it in. And then I put my makeup and everything in my little suitcase because this one can't really ever go overweight. Put all my like really heavy stuff in this one and then clothing and stuff in this one. Packing sucks.